In this video, we'll examine Tesla's new master plan in more detail. We'll examine the three main pillars of the strategy in order to set the stage for a world that is no longer dependent on fossil fuels. Electric automobiles, battery storage, solar energy production, and heat pumps, so buckle up, because we're about to witness the dawn of a new era in sustainable energy. First things first, make sure that you subscribe to our channel and that you gave this video a big thumbs up, so sit back, relax, and let's jump in. Tesla has always been committed to accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy. Specifically, we'll be focusing on heat pumps and how they work and we'll examine Tesla's innovative approach to using heat pumps in their electric vehicles, battery storage, solar energy production, and heat pumps. Elon Musk and his Tesla team claim that the widespread use of heat pumps for residential and industrial settings will the new master plan is essentially a roadmap to a sustainable future where the world has eliminated 100 of its dependency on fossil fuels. To achieve this goal, we need to stop burning things for energy, including coal and petrol. Heat things will be just as effective as electric vehicles for reducing fossil fuel consumption. Initially diesel and then natural gas, gas stoves and heaters must be replaced with cleaner energy sources if we are to fully move to sustainable energy. Alternatives include electric heat pumps. According to the master plan, switching all vehicles worldwide to electric power will reduce fossil fuel consumption by 21 while switching completely to heat pumps will result in a 22 reduction. In addition, the cost of switching completely to heat pumps is only $0.3 trillion compared to $7 trillion for switching all vehicles worldwide to battery power. While it may seem contradictory, a heat pump is an efficient electric heater that moves heat rather than producing it. It collects heat from the outside and moves it inside, making it the perfect heating option for homes and businesses. According to experts, the temperature difference between water in a pool and a person's body is higher than normal. But as one spends more time in the pool, the station of cold dissipates because the heat energy in their body matches the energy in the water. The second law of thermodynamics, which states that hot always moves to the side, supports this idea by stating that hot always moves to the side. Heat pumps employ this natural law to their advantage by transferring energy from outside to within the building. Refrigerant, a liquid with a very low boiling point that vaporizes at room temperature, is what heat pumps actually pump instead of heat. In the past, refrigerants were bad for the environment because they caused a hole in the ozone layer, but modern refrigerants like R134 do not cause the same harm. The moving component of a heat pump that compresses vaporized refrigerant to raise temperature and energy density is called a compressor. After that, a wall-mounted blower system uses the hot gas to blast room temperature air over a coil of hot gas. The refrigerant cools down as the heat energy from the compressed gas follows the airflow into the space. To complete its next task, the refrigerant needs to become even colder so it passes through an expansion valve to rapidly lower the pressure and return the temperature to where the chemical is liquid once more, typically at negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit or negative 30 degrees Celsius. The extremely cold liquid is then sent to the heat pump's exterior coil, where it takes energy from the outside air. As the refrigerant warms up and boils into a gas, it is then compressed and heated even more before being pumped into the home. Tesla employed electric resistive heating until they released the Model Y in 2020, which was their first heat pump. Every car uses a low-efficiency heating technique called resistive heating, which transfers energy from the battery into a coil of metal. The traditional resistive heating techniques used by most electric cars use a lot of energy and reduce driving range. However, Tesla has adopted a different strategy with their Model Y which uses a highly efficient heat pump to keep the cabin warm in cold weather. The heat pump works by using a refrigerant that rapidly compresses and decompresses in order to transfer heat. This system is far simpler and more efficient than the Ford Mustang Mark E's heat pump system, which utilizes 35 components in 18.4 meters of hose and is quite effective. It just requires 10 individual components and 6.3 meters of hose. The engineers at Tesla aim to duplicate the concept of a circuit board where all required parts and connectors are integrated into a single piece in the design of the heat pump by packing the entire thermal system into a single unit that is about the size of a basketball. This novel method of warming an electric vehicle's interior has contributed to dispelling the idea that EVS are ineffective in cold locations. 
It's not surprising that other automakers are finding it difficult to compete with Tesla given that the Model Y's heat pump is a brilliant illustration of the company's dedication to innovation and efficiency. The way we think about heating and cooling in electric vehicles is being revolutionized by Tesla's development of a novel and effective heat pump. Tesla's heat pump design solves this problem and is significantly more efficient than competing models, making electric cars more useful in cold climates. The resistance of the metal used in the system concentrates energy increasing the temperature and a fan blows cool air over the metal coil resulting in the hot air being directed towards the cabin of the car, decreasing vehicle range. The octal valve, a small and effective thermal system, the size of a basketball that enables the heat pump to operate in reverse and eliminates the need for separate heating and cooling units, was developed by Tesla's engineers after being inspired by the design of a circuit board. Afterward, they created a completely automated manufacturing process for their heat pump that has a 99995% success rate at high quality and enables them to make one of their super manifolds every 7 seconds. Tesla has hinted at creating a home HVAC system that uses the same heat pump technology as their electric automobiles, which might completely change how we heat and cool our houses. The Tesla heat pump system is a groundbreaking innovation that has the potential to change how we heat and cool our cars and homes. The company's distinctive design and fully automated manufacturing system are setting a new standard in the industry. Elon Musk has stated that the current heat pump design can be scaled up to heat a house or even a business. If Tesla can deliver the same level of efficiency and manufacturing scale at larger sizes, Thank you for watching our video on Tesla's new master plan for a sustainable future as we've seen the adoption of heat pumps for home and industrial heating, which reveals heat pumps as a key solution for reducing fossil fuel consumption and accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy. By adopting heat pumps for home and industrial heating, we can eliminate our reliance on natural gas and achieve a sustainable future with more than enough energy to power our global civilization. It is understandable that other manufacturers are finding it difficult to keep up with Tesla's groundbreaking innovations given its innovative approach to heating and cooling that uses a highly efficient heat pump. Again, join us in our dedication to a sustainable future and let's all work together to create a cleaner, greener world. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. I appreciate you viewing and I'll see you in a future video.